is a dense, spherical, non-membrane-bound structure found in the nucleus of the cell. It's composed of primarily proteins and nucleic acids. Its main function is to trans-5 ribosomal RNA and combine it with proteins to form ribosomes. The nucleolus also can capture and immobilize proteins, thereby preventing cellular interaction with their binding partners. This helps regulate cellular activity. Inside each human cell, there is approximately six feet of DNA existing as 46 chromatin strands. Normally, this DNA is dispersed in a somewhat loose configuration. However, when the cell is preparing to divide, each strand of DNA is condensed by a factor of 10,000 times into a structure called a chromosome. This folding and repackaging serves to facilitate the process of cell division. When the cell divides, the chromosomes separate, providing a complete copy of the generic information to each cell. are hollow protein structures that penetrate the nuclear membrane and act as doorways between the nucleus and the cytoplasm. They allow small molecules and ions to freely pass into or out of the nucleus, but also may allow larger proteins to enter the nucleus from the cytoplasm if the proteins have special sequences, or tags, that indicate they belong in the nucleus. In the same way as proteins are allowed to enter, RNA transcribed in the nucleus and proteins destined to enter the cytoplasm have export sequences that tag them for release through the nuclear pores. The nuclear membrane consists of two lipid bilayers, the inner nuclear membrane and the outer nuclear membrane. The function of the nuclear membrane is to separate the nucleus and the nucleolus from the rest of the cell contents. The nuclear membrane is embedded with special proteins called nuclear pores, which act as specific doorways that permit substances such as nutrients, waste, and cellular information to pass into and out of the nucleus. The nucleus is a membrane-bound organelle that contains most of the cell's genetic material. The interior of the nucleus does not contain any membrane-bound organelles or compartments. Its contents are non-uniform and consists of a number of subnuclear bodies like the nucleolus. The genetic material in the nucleus is organized as multiple linear DNA molecules combined with a variety of proteins to form chromosomes. The genes within these chromosomes are the cell's nuclear genome. The function of the nucleus is to maintain the integrity of these genes and to control the activities of the cell by regulating gene expression. The nucleus can therefore be considered the control center of the cell. The nucleus is a membrane...